The state's collective bargaining law is facing two challenges this morning. KCCI's Tommy Clark is live at the Judicial Branch building to tell us who is fighting against this law. Tommy. Yeah, guys, this is all about Iowa's tens of thousands of public employees who say that this collective bargaining law has really stripped away their basic rights when it does come to collective bargaining. Now, for both of these cases today, they'll go before the Iowa Supreme Court. They're challenging this law that was passed in January of 2017. The law scales back a four decades old law that governs union contract negotiations for the state's public workers. In this first case, AFSCME is asking the court to consider whether the law violates the Iowa Constitution by giving more rights to some public employees, but not to other identically situated public employees. And if it infringes on their right to be represented by the state workers union. Now we'll speak with the AFSCME Council 61 president before oral arguments later this morning. And in your next half hour, we'll tell you the details about the other challenger, this time coming from the organization that represents Iowa's teachers. Now reporting live from the Judicial Building, I'm Tommy Clark, KCCI 8 News, Iowa's News Leader.